Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm here today to share with you another Illustrator Spotlight. And today's artist, featured artist is, and now comes the fun part, uh, Maud Lemoyne, I think that's her name. Um, she goes by the name Dream and Fantasy on uh, Etsy. And uh, yeah, I want to show you some works of her. As you can see, I have a printed PDF and I also have uh, a book of hers, which arrived not too long ago. And um, yeah, I think I saw her works, or no, I think I saw one of her coloring pictures um, colored by uh, one of the French people I follow on Instagram. And um, I thought this style looks very, very nice and very um, whimsical. So I decided to take a look at her Etsy shop and um, yeah, uh, she has, I think, f four or five books online from, with all different sorts of uh, themes to choose from. Um, I think this one was um, this was a mixture of all kinds of stuff, but there was also one with fairy tales and there was one with only females and um, what else? I um, can't remember anymore. Which is bullshit because I have my phone right next to me. So I will quickly look it up. Um, one second. I bought way too many. Um, there we go. We have like something with mystery. We have beautiful women. Um, what else? Something with storybooks. So maybe something with s songs or so. I'm not sure. One's called Dream and Fantasy, and the one I have is called. Uh, yeah, I don't know between. Between Dawn, maybe, something like that. Um, but yeah, she has all different kinds of um, books online, so go check her out. And she recently started to upload also PDFs, which I'm very happy about. Um, because I love PDFs and I love to print them on my own paper. And um, yeah, well, I will start first with the PDF because this was the simple one. It's called The Last Goodbye and I saw it and I knew I wanted to have it because it spoke to me. It's so beautiful, very, very beautiful. And um, it's two elvish people and I'm assuming that maybe he is going away or she has to go away. I'm assuming they have to separate uh, each other, so... Yeah, very, very pretty. And um, then we come to the book. Um, I got a very beautiful postcard with it. Um, I don't know, what's it called? La Clé de Mon Coeur. Uh, um, something with a heart. <laughs> Coeur is full uh, Yeah, I think Coeur is something with is, is a heart, um, if I remember correctly. My French is not very good. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, it's this beautiful illustration which will sit on my desk probably to inspire me because it's very beautiful. And then we have the actual book, which is Spiral Bound, which we all love. It has a very glossy cover, as you can see. It's probably, no, now the glare is gone, but minutes before you had the glare, I'm very sorry for that. <clears throat> you have the front side and on the back side it says... Um, Something with a night and mysteries. Uh, something with discovering. Uh, 25 illustrations for coloring. Um, something with enlightening and maybe let let you let transport tra transport you into something like that. Like I said, I am not very good at French, <laughs> but I think I get the, the essence out of this. And you can see two, three of the. Um, pictures already and when we jump in it says right away that this is uh, 
this book belongs to Paige, and it says here also Maud Lemoy. And she has a Facebook page, Dream and Fantasy Art Gallery. And I think I saw her also on, on Instagram. If I if I can find her Instagram link, I will uh, put the link in the scri description box down below. Now the paper itself is very lovely and thick. It's bright white, but it's very thick. Um, not too smooth, a bit a bit on the smoother side, but not too smooth. Um, uh, I would say <clears throat> it maybe compares to the paper in Anastasia called the River books. And according to my friend, um, polychromos are working very good on that paper. So I'm assuming that they have to be working well, very well on this one as well. And yeah, then we jump right in and uh, yeah, those are those very pretty illustrations. As you can see, there is a sort of grayscale, a little bit shading into it, but not too much. So you can still add your own shading. And um, yeah, I won't flip through the whole book. I will just show you a few pictures of it. Oh, there's this horse picture. This one's pretty with the wolf. This one's also very pretty. Then you have, this one is the one from the cover. <clears throat> Excuse me, a very, very pretty page. And uh, yeah. Oh, she's also gorgeous. <laughs> pretty. But yeah, that is the book. And um, that is a very short video today, I know that. But nonetheless, I wanted to show you these things because I think she needs more more attention because her work is gorgeous and very, very pretty. Um, she has different uh, PDFs on the website, like I said before. Um, <clears throat> there were, I think three came out of this book, but there were also three more came out of another book. And um, yeah, all different kinds of PDFs. So I will um, suggest you check out her Etsy store and um, show her some love <laughs> um, because I think it is a really, really gorgeous style and it will probably not my last book I purchased by her. But yeah, that was all for today. Um, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up, like and subscribe the video, like, like the video, subscribe to my channel. Join my little community on uh, YouTube. You can also follow me on Instagram. Um, yeah, and there's nothing more left than to wish you a very happy day wherever you are. And I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.